So here's a truck for high level Alberta. We just built, it's on a Spartan Furion chassis. You can see it's got the uh, black and dark red paint scheme. Got the uh, graphics there. The unit numbers rescue one with the black swoosh. The first compartment here, we've got the electric reel for the junction box, the command light controls, the 12 volt panel back there. Two, uh, two flashlights. And there's the command light up there. Two, two metal halides with the back light. We've got a Wayland 900 series super LED warning light with a scene light there. We've got a transverse module here for Stokes baskets and backboards or whatever have you. We've got uh, on scene straps so you can get to your uh, stuff there. Got two thousand pound trays here, or two one thousand pound trays, excuse me. Full or full one hundred percent extension, as on the other side. This one's a transverse tray that uh, comes out either side. Only extends seventy percent of the way though. Over the axle, we got another thousand pound tray. Behind that we've got uh, two pull out tool boards. There's a 600 series whaling here as well as a 120 volt 20 amp outlet. Got some more warning lights up here. The wheel chocks are under there. There's another 600 series whaling. All the stop tail turn and warning lights. Some warning lights there. There's the backup camera. Traffic advisor right now it's just on flash. You can set it to left, right, center out. A bunch of other different patterns. You got two core hydraulic hoses or reels in here with hose that are pre-connected to tools that are mounted on a slide out tool board here. So you see there you got uh, looks like some cutters or spreaders. And you got a ram down there and over here you got a bigger ram as well as uh, some cutters there and a little portable power unit and then the switch for the power unit here and then the real rewind up on the top here you got the ladder that actually folds up when it's not in use. Got your upper body storage compartments here. Got a 6,000 pound ASME or 6,000 PSI bottle here. ASME for the low pressure air. Reel on the other side of the truck. You got your light tower. Got the top of the cab there with the light bar. Just some more open storage here. And then when this door is closed, you actually have a little assist handle so you can grab on when you're at the top of the ladder. Got a 400 pound tray here, just a pull out tray. Got a out and down tray there. Got a couple of uh, tool boards to slide out, some heavy duty ones. There's one of them, and there's the other one. Got the other side of the transverse module here. Got your other 1,000 pound tray. And just open storage down below that. Got your 120 volt area. As well as your generator monitoring panel and your cab tilt pendant. And here's the controls for the low pressure air reel. So you can shut the whole thing off or turn it on. There's your regulated pressure. 
there's your regulator, that's what your storage PSI is at, and then there's your refill port, there's the low pressure air reel right there, and there's the electric reel, the junction box on there. This side, you've got, you've got the same lighting package as on the other side, 900s and 600s. In the back of the cab, you've got seating for six. There's the driver and there's the officer. You got uh, helmet to brackets on the ceiling, and then two on each side of the rear wall. Seating for two here in the back. There's the other two helmet brackets. Got a little cabinet with the light there. And then also some more storage for maps or whatever have you. There's just some paperwork in there now. And then you've got store or switches for your master, your light bar, your warning lights, heater, driver heater, mud snow traction, electric or air horn or electric high idle ground lights, um, officer heater, heated mirror, and here's your uh, traffic advisor settings. Go center out to the right or to the left. Then you have low power intensity as well. You can just barely see that as opposed to that. And then just center is off. Then you got your siren controller there. And then uh, pre-wire for a cell phone. And there's your backup camera. Monitor. Some 600 series on the front bumper as well as on the front of the chassis. You got some storage compartments here in the bumper as well as the wind. There's the car lead. There's another storage compartment.